Hello and welcome. Today we are going to learn the basics of the solid work surface. And in the solid work surface, we are going to cover the excluded surface and the all options available in the excluded surface part in detail. In the excluded surface, we will practice the exclusion in the two directions that is direction 1 and direction 2 and the different in conditions like the blind mid plane up to vertex up to surface and we'll study the important options available in the excluded surface that is the offset from surface and the reverse offset translate offsets, offsets also and we'll try the end cap that is you can see there is a end cap and there is a no any cap that is open at that part and in this part there is a close part and that is done by the end cap option and we will also practice the draft on and off that is draft outward and draft inward and at the end we will practice the selected contours also so let's start create a new part file Let's change the background to plain white and select any plane. Now I'm going to take the three point arc. I start from here and drop anywhere you like and draw a simple arc. Let's define it. The radius is 70. You can define any radius. The distance from this point to origin is let's say 15 and distance from the origin to this point is again take this more dimension and this distance is 100 mm okay now go to the surface and select the excluded surface now you can see the preview now here are different options available in, the, in conditions in the direction one the blind this one is blind and you can provide the any dimensions let's say 50 now this is 50 mm exclude from the from this cob now let's select the mid plane option now in the mid plane you will find the exclusion in the two directions that is 25 mm in this side and 25 mm in this side click ok now this is the extruded surface again go to edit the feature now here are other options up to vertex up to surface offset from surface up to body now to practice this we have to draw the other drawing also go to this top plane sketch normal now choose the center rectangle and in the center part draw a free center rectangle okay and take the dimension command to dimension it 50 mm this one let's say 30 mm this sketch is still not fully defined so you have to dimension this length 50 still it is under defined now exit the small dimension and press ctrl key to select these two points origin point again select this point and origin point to provide the horizontal now the sketch is fully defined okay now rotate it to where the draw how to redrawing now we'll try different options available in the excluded surface now this time select up to surface this is very important tool in the exclusion even in the feature exclude and also in the surface exclude now you have to select the surface up to surface is selected as in condition so here you have to select up to face plane now we are going to select this plane 
now it will exclude only up to this surface and it will automatically create the shape of this end click ok you can apply the color now let's apply red color ok and in the surface too you can apply any color you want I'm going to apply this one uh, this one is ok now again go to the exclude surface now you can select direction 2 and in the direction 2 if you select the blind and provide the 20 mm now it's open at that end to fill this you have to select the end cap the end cap option is not available in the feature but end cap is available in the surface exclude so if you apply the end cap and you can see the result here now there is no any surface but if you select the end cap you will your end will be filled with the planar surface click ok now again go to the edit feature now we are going to practice the offset from surface select offset from surface and provide let's say 5 mm this is in the direction one so 5 mm offset from this plane or you can change the offset direction if you reverse the offset you can do it now the offset is opposite in the opposite direction from this curve plane and here is the translate surface options if the larger offset is required you can select the translate offset of translate surface options see the difference using the translate surface click ok now this is the offset from surface again go to edit feature now let's choose the blind and here is a option available draft on enough you can apply this in the both the direction direction one and direction two and let's practice with the direction two and select draft on and off now provide the angle let's say 20 degree and see the result now check the draft outward first and you will find the draft in the outward direction and click ok now this is the draft command same as in the feature now again go to the edit feature and here is a selected contours options to practice this we have to first of all draw the contours for this delete this and go to this sketch and edit the sketch normal now let's draw some lines here join it again take the line and join these two corners okay now there are different contours available simply select the surface and exclude surface now in the selected contours you can select the desired contours now i'm going to select these contours or even if you can select this contour also and all other options are same you can use the in cap in the direction one and also in the direction two and simply click ok now in this way the surface extrude is slightly different than the feature extrude so 
this much in the surface extrude I try to cover all the options available in the extruded surface. I hope you learned something from this video. Thank you for your time.